Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from vitalcoaching.com and we are talking about vital sex and ejaculation mastery for men. So if you watched the previous video, you know already that I mentioned that preserving your sexual energy is one of the core aspects that you can start cultivating and practicing if this is something you feel appealed to try, okay? So, the topic of ejaculation mastery, which is a good way of putting it, what you want is not necessarily to block your ejaculation or ejaculation control. The term of ejaculation mastery means that you choose if you want to come, if you want to ejaculate, if you want to lose semen or not, and you decide when it happens, and if you decide not to come at all, not to have ejaculation at all for an extended period of time, you can easily do that. So, here are a few hints on how to do that. The first thing to understand is that it's a training, okay? Your lingam, your penis, is a muscle. It's something that you can actually practice and train. With more practice, the more you practice, the better you become at it. It's, it's not just like a pressure point or a trick on how to block ejaculation. It's really something that you engage into and a little bit like playing music, you learn the tricks and eventually you learn how to become really good at it. It takes practice. Okay, if you don't have sex at all for a month and then you decide to go and have sex and or you have an opportunity to share this juicy time with a lover, then you have sex once and then you no lover for like a month, it's going to be challenging to build up the, uh, the, the juice and the energy to actually uh, practice ejaculation mastery. So it's a training, okay? It's like something that you practice frequently and eventually you become really good at it. The, the second important element is this. Through porn education and through all sorts of vision that we have in our minds, very often we believe that sex needs to be this passionate movement of energy where we engage with, with a high energy and with lots of fire and uh, that somehow your movements as a male need to be fast and deep penetration and so on. Uh, that's not true at all. That's one possible style, but the idea here if you want to practice ejaculation mastery, is really to slow down. Just to take it more slowly, okay? You can enter, penetrate a woman and be there and stay there without moving at all. We will talk about how to coach your, your girlfriend or how to inspire her to help you with these techniques, but that's the first thing. It's simple. Slow down. If after two minutes of fast movement, you would naturally ejaculate and slow down and practice the art of, you know, relaxing with, uh, with this. So how do you slow down? The first thing is that you can stop, okay? You can stop altogether. You can pull back. You can uh, um, relax next to each other with no penetration and simply stay there digesting the uh, overload or the uh, extreme maybe passion or sexual energy that you might be feeling so you slow down or you stop altogether the um, the another aspect that you can use which is very important is that you can use your breathing for instance if you are you know into very active passionate intercourse you can slow down and uh, focus a little bit on your breathing so you you start, you start breathing a little bit more slowly and slowing uh, down your, your movements, are also your sexual movement. So um, the, another aspect or something that you can practice is uh, using sequences. So you can breathe in and out like five, ten times while you are uh, in intercourse position. And uh, for instance, it might sound like this. <sighs> So this is associated with a penetration movement and then after 10 times you, you stop and you hold your breath and then you do that again and again and again and you might do 5, 10, 20 sequences like that. So this has the power to build up you know, sexual tension and sexual intensity without bringing you all the way to ejaculation. Again, it's an art, okay? It's not just a recipe that you apply like that. Because we are programmed by nature to procreate, of course, nature is not going to say, okay, we are going to make it easy for you, because if we did, uh, then uh, no babies would be born and that would be the end of the human race. So 
we are programmed by nature to really uh, ejaculate as much as we can. But there is something that comes in, which is culture, training. Your mind can, can start uh, guiding a little bit these animal instincts and direct you in a different, different way. So, so far, train, uh, slow down, and use those different sequences and breathing techniques. The third one, coach your lover. Okay, the communication aspect is very important here. If you have a lover, a wife, a partner who has no idea while you're holding back, what's going on there? She will be very confused. She will be like, maybe believe that you are not appreciating the sex, that uh, she's doing something wrong or something like that. So you can, before you engage into uh, sex with her, if she's a new lover, and even if it's somebody with who you already had uh, intercourse before or who has been your partner for a while, you can really talk about these things. Have feedback minute times, have communication times where you explain really what your intention is. So this has to do with uh, sexual communication, being able to, to share all that and having your girlfriend or your lover on board really uh, helping you with these techniques is super important because then it really synchronizes your movement and uh, your uh, your energy. Another aspect that is very important is to experiment, to dare to try new things. You know, here what I'm giving you is a certain set of uh, recipes and uh, ideas, but then really what makes you really good at it is the fact that you are able to play with these different ideas and techniques and start expanding with them. You know, you have other ejaculation control techniques that you can use, you know, like certain pressure points that you can use and so on. But uh, honestly, in my experience, what works the best is, is simply that, is slowing down and letting your girlfriend or lover, partner know why it's important for you so that she can help you with that. Okay, I hope you have fun. See you soon, bye-bye.